Hello, it's Paul from Powderman Entertainment and today I'd like to talk to you about a couple of new announcements we have. Firstly, we have a sale on. Right now, on the website, 15% off all our products, uh, free shipping to the UK over uh, £50. And uh, this is our Black Friday sale and this will last from today until the 30th of November. So that's wonderful. That's not all I thought to announce today. Being that it's St Edmund's Day, I did also promise a couple more big announcements. The second thing I have to announce is the critical update on threat level emergency response. I know that a lot of people have um, recently heard me say that I, I'm doing a 2.1, just making a few cosmetic changes. Um, being that, you know, Tube Psych was uh, the first edition and that was focused very much on the British Transport Police where the second edition is the other emergency services um, and we're actually doing a third edition not 2.1 now this is because when i, I hired a bunch of playtesters and they've gone oh you could do this you could do that you could do this and i went wonderful these sound great ideas we play tested them as well hours of play testing uh, have gone into it since since i started um and yeah so Basically, some of the core elements have changed, bits and bobs have, have altered, and we're now sort of making it bigger, better than ever before. So the core changes have happened. Um, we're releasing early 2023, January, February time. Now, this brings me on to my last major announcement. Now, since Threat Level Emergency Response came out, I have wanted to develop a competitive game that's made for two or more people and should be fun and have competitive events linked to it. It needed to be interesting, but it also needed to not be modern combat. I wanted something a little different than I've already been doing. And uh, so I've been working on this on and off for quite some time in top secret. Only only the sort of top echelons of the Pandyman Tower were allowed to know. And we're finally at the point where I can I can announce it. Actually, I'm really excited to do this. So it shares the same system as Fret Level, with it being a 2D6 system. It is centred around the trench fighting of World War One. So it's a World War One style war game. And that will be released in April, actually the 1st of April, at Chilcon. And that is going to have a different scale of 54 mil. And at release, there'll be two factions, the Germans and the British. And the combat is fast, it's bloody, and it's uh, really good fun. So this is something that I'll talk more about in, in Designer Diaries as well, so that you're sort of kept up to date with this. What does that mean for Threat Level? That means that we're still doing both. We're actually doing two games. Um, one will, will, you know, will always be sort of on the back burner. I, I do sort of try and alternate between the two and um, and I've been sort of doing two for the last couple of years anyway, so since 2021. And that, yeah, as I said, comes out on the 1st of April, 2023. And we're really excited about that. So yeah, so that's really the major, the, the major sort of talking points today is those three big subjects. We will be supporting both games um, constantly and we'll be looking to always improve both of those equally. Um, there'll be miniatures, there'll be, you know, more coming out. It's all about creating experiences for you, the players. Um, we also wanted to, um, I just wanted a quick update on the shields. We're doing a limited run I'm not sure how many yet. We're still sort of making those. Uh, we're making them in-house, so they should be a little cheaper than they were going to be, um, especially at a time like this at the moment. They will be out at a similar time to the third edition. They will be a limited run, so they will literally be only X amount made ever. We will not be making any more. And once they're made, that's it. I'm... I'm <laughs> They are so much, the clear shields are so much hard work. I might make some that are resin shields where they're just the grey ones, so you can paint them if you wish. But uh, yeah, no, the, the clear shields will be limited in number. 
Um, but yeah, so that'll be coming out early next year, but I'll be keeping you updated on that as well. So that'll be another video showing you how to paint them and how to deal with them. That is it for Paddy Man today. I look forward to seeing you all at a show soon. And um, yeah, I can't wait. It's going to be a great time. Have a great time. Peace.